Look at what Lenny's been working on for the past like <laughs> two weeks. Small. I'm so proud of her. Okay, so every night after dinner, she's been adding to her beautiful Overwatch collection. Let's do a little tour. I know it says my name at the top, but these are Lenny's. It was, my name is from something else. So this is our boy McCree. He was the first one. He was the first he's one. A less detailed than anybody else. <laughs> he's what started it all. Uh, yeah. Then we had Soldier, I believe. Then we had Reaper. Oh, sorry. <gasps> sorry. Then we had uh, Reaper. Because he's McCree's dad, so, you know, it was, like a, it was related. He's pretty good, you know, like, I like his little mask. Very good. Then we had to do Reaper's husband. Well, Lenny did Reaper's husband. We've got uh, Grillmaster76 here. Raise the stakes. Then we have uh, Anna to complete the trio. She looks so wholesome and cute. I love how wholesome she is. Everyone uh, else is just kind of... Look at that little Something's face. happened to them. Then we added Hanzo, or Lenny added Hanzo, uh... To go with McCree. I drew his head, and I didn't draw the rest of him until after dinner, and I, his head's the best part. His head is really great. Look at that angry face with the little, the little sideburn floofs. Uh, and then we have Genji and Zenyatta, who are honestly the most adorable. Look how I'm cute that is. Uh, <laughs> so cute. Then there's Mercy, who turned <laughs> out very proud of her. interesting. <laughs> <laughs> then we've got Sombra, who actually looks pretty great. Look at that angry little face. I forgot what she looked like, because I was in the middle of drawing her, and I kind of went, oh, you know, what does she look like? Improvisation. And then, mm -hmm. my fave boys, we got mm -hmm. Junkrat and Red Hawk. <laughs> I just added them. <laughs> I love Junkrat's wonderful hair. Also, Red Hawk's the only character who deserved nipples. <laughs> Hanzo didn't get any, only Red Hawk. Hanzo earned them. Hanzo hasn't earned them. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you enjoy Lenny's uh, Overwatch art. There's also a whale and a cat that I drew ages ago, but this is the real content, guys. This is art. Oh, I really need a haircut. Also, how do you like the terrible lighting in my room at night, huh? My lighting system is like a bunch of weird red lights on my ceiling, so it looks like I'm in some kind of murder room. Wow. But anyways, what I was going to say uh, is I've been catching up on the Adventure Zone. Uh, if you don't know what the Adventure Zone is, it's a really, really, really good D&D podcast that I really love. Uh, and I was a little bit behind on it, but I've been catching up. I have one more episode and then I'm all caught up because in like two days, on the 17th, uh, the finale is coming out. The last episode of this campaign this D&D campaign of the Adventure Zone. And I'm super, super, super excited. Um, tomorrow I'm gonna uh, catch up to the most recent episode and I'll probably talk about it more and like how hyped I am for the finale. Uh, but I just wanted to say like, oh my God, it's such a good podcast, guys. If you have not, if you have not listened to the Adventure Zone, I mean, you probably can't catch up between now and the 17th. It's like probably physically impossible with the amount of hours of podcasts there are because there's like 68 episodes and they're each like over an hour so you probably physically can't catch up between now and the 17th but you could start and then listen to the finale when you get there because it's so it's so good like <clears throat> if you like fantasy and D&D &D and all of that it's really really fun D&D &D. uh the guys who do it are super super funny and great guys uh there's amazing representation there's amazing characters it's funny it's fun it's deep it's time travel it's magic it's so good and I just felt the need to tell you about it because I was thinking about how good it is and how much I love it and how excited I am for the end. Um, and it's like, uh, I'm glad it's ending, not because I'm like, oh, it sucks, I want it to end, but because, like, they've told a really, really good, concise story and I wouldn't want them to drag it out just for the sake of dragging it out. So I'm super, super excited for them to conclude this really good story and I can't wait to find out what happens. Uh, so that's my little uh, rant about how good the Dungeons and Dragons podcast, The Adventure Zone is. Uh, Cause it's late and I'm tired and I didn't have anything else to say today except that I listened to a lot of The Adventure Zone and it's really, really good. You should go listen to it. That's your recommendation for the day. Yesterday was Boku no Hero Academia. Today is the Adventure Zone. Maybe I'll just start putting this in all my vlogs. What should you go listen to or watch today? I don't know. Also play Overwatch. That's just generally my recommendation all the time. Play Overwatch. That's also what I did tonight. But also the Adventure Zone. Go listen to it. So good. <laughs>